Like Marlo said, have you gotten our today's special yet? If you haven't, you must. Got bowls? Got bowls of shame? If you have those tired, those worn, those stained, those dented, and let's be honest, we all do, you must try these. I actually ordered mine at 12 midnight because I knew they would sell out early. With well over 17,000 gone, we've sold out of several of the colors. Allison, is it fair to say more than two thirds of the inventory is already spoken for? So more than two thirds of the inventory is completely spoken for. All right, if you want the turquoise, we have the final 300. Black is probably the best choice in terms of availability. Am I correct in saying that? Oh, red. Oh, well, get arrested, red. So if you want that red, that's gonna be your best choice, but I say best choice in quotation marks because we don't have a lot of those either. And then the black. And what's genius about this is everything. They are 1810 stainless. They are oven safe up to 400 degrees without the lids. They have the measuring marks. They have the silicone base. So if you're using them as a regular mixing bowl, then you don't have to worry about wobbling around. It has a number of features that are upgrades. Love the silicone handle, which makes it easy when I'm doing cake mixes or even when you're tossing a salad, it makes it easy to get to. This is a new little upgraded lid that has this wonderful little um, insert. So whether you're doing salads or you're adding cheese later, that makes it easy to add those ingredients. And then if you come on over here, they all nest together, which I think is genius. He has added... <laughs> Well, I would say cook and look lids, but of course these lids you don't put in the oven, but you can see what's going on. So whether you're sealing your ice cream and putting it in the freezer or the refrigerator, yes, dishwasher's safe, but you'll just rinse these out. I know Marion uses a dry erase marker to write um, ingredients on the top. And then for the first time in history, you're also getting what we call the minis. And these we always used to sell separately. In fact, Allison, do we have those on hsn.com that we can show? Um, because I know normally we do sell those minis separately. We are doing them right here, right now, and basically for this show or as long as supplies last. So we'd love to hear from you. That testimonial talk line is open. Oh, thank you, Allison. As a case in point, you could buy more separately, and many of you out there are, but I hope you try these because if you're like me, I posted that pasta salad earlier. I, I do a lot of things in my kitchen. I'm no Wolfgang Puck, but I've learned more from Wolfgang than any other chef I've ever worked with in my life. I've known him for over 20 years. And Wolfgang, even if you aren't a great cook, you have to have the right tools. And the bowls are the perfect place to start, right? Yep, absolutely. You know what? Without the bowls, you're gonna make salad how? You know, you're gonna mix it in your saute pan? No, you need it. You wanna serve it outside in it. You have the clear lid on top, so that way the flies won't get to it before people get to it. So it is really an important part. But obviously you saw you get the clear lid, but you get another lid with the big, with the five quart bowl, which has a slicer and two graders, one coarse, one fine. Now the fine one I use for Parmesan. The coarse one, you can also grate cheese on it, like cheddar cheese or vegetables. So here I'm making my Chinoa chicken salad. So what we do is use some cabbage and then I'm gonna add some other vegetables, the veggies you like. So you decide what you wanna put in here. We have cucumbers on the slicer. Okay, and then if I wanna get carrots, for example, which are really delicious with it, then I'm gonna use the big grater. So here is the grater. Okay, and then I can grate my carrots. And Wolfgang, I'm just like your cookware, I'm correct in saying these don't warp, they don't tarnish, they it's, don't oxidize, right? This is lifetime. This you're gonna have for the rest of your life. Unfortunately for me, because I won't be able to sell you another, uh, another set of bowls. Now look at the beautiful vegetables in here. Can you see them? Look at that. Perfectly sliced, diced, whatever you want. We have a little chicken breast, which we cooked and marinated before. So now I have that. Now I'm gonna make the vinaigrette. 
Let's see here. So we have a little bit of rice wine vinegar in here, some soy sauce, some Chinese mustard. We mix it well together. It's a honey mustard vinaigrette. We're gonna put a little honey in here. And look, these bowls have the silicone bottom. So this is really the best way because it doesn't move, so it stays still. You can see that here, look at that. I'm adding the oil to my vinaigrette and the bowl stays still. So now, all I have to do is pour it over my chicken salad. Okay, and that's it. And if I wanna keep that, I can keep that. The rest of it. Okay, let's put it on the side and get my little tongue here and I'm gonna mix it together. Beautiful. Hey, Wolfgang, they are telling me, now remember this, and I've got one more show in my Shamans in the House show coming up next hour. Yeah. This is it. So if you want that turquoise, we have the final Allison 300. Am I correct in saying that? So, okay, final 200 of that turquoise. Black is actually gonna sell out next and then the red, but regardless, they're already planning like a this day only an abbreviated look at our today's special in the, in the house show. And remember, it's not just this one bowl. They all nest. So you are getting that one and a half, you're getting your three, you're getting your five, you're getting two of these great 1810 stainless mixing, cooking, baking bowls. Remember, without these new enhanced little peekaboo windows, everything else is oven safe without the lids, of course, up to 400 degrees in your oven. Put a little dry erase marker on there if you can't remember when you made that salad or you can't remember when you made that vinaigrette, but they are going. Do you know with a $13.32 flex pay, I don't care whether you cook a little or a lot. I, I know I'm not unique in saying this. You will use these every day, whether it's check mix or popcorn. A lot of you, Wolfgang, I know you talked about this. A lot of people even use the little guys for pet bowls because those stainless pet bowls at the, the pet store could cost you what you see on your screen, right? Absolutely, but you know, I use it for bakeware. I put salt in it. If I cook a lot, I have it right next to me. If I don't I have my meal, my salt meal or my spice meal, this is really the best way. There is no other bowl which is made like that. 18 and stainless steel, a clear through sea uh, cup, and also a pressure valve so that way you really can seal it totally hermetically. That's what I like with this bowl. You can see in it what you have, so it's easy. So I have my Chinois chicken salad here, and the rest, I'm gonna keep it cold because somebody's coming home a little bit later. So this is really perfect. So see how easy, how fast, no problem at all. Now, marinating. You know, if you wanna marinate something, you add liquid to it, oil to it, garlic to it, and everything. And look at that. Here I have liquid in here, uh, some oil, some garlic, some ginger, some coconut milk, a little soy sauce, and nothing comes out. So now I'm gonna open the valve here, and look here. See, I have so much stuff in here to marinate my chicken breast. So, if you want to get a delicious chicken salad, well, if you give some flavor to your chicken press, like by marinating it, you're going to get a better chicken salad. And then put it on your grill, in your pan, in the oven, whatever you like. If you have some leftover, again, just clean it up, open it up, and put that together, and look at that. Nothing comes out. Hermetically sealed to perfection. It is. Hey, Wolfgang, now. we are going to be calling that turquoise sold out here in just a moment. Hey, I should also let you know, remember, these little peekaboo lids, love that little silicone handle. Well, did you hear that? That's that Let's silicone seal, that little silicone seal for that extra freshness. So if you are doing things like a salad like Wolfgang is, you yeah. don't have to worry about warping, tarnishing, oxidizing. Okay. If you want that yeah. turquoise, we're looking at the last 100. So final 100 on that turquoise. 
hands down, we will be calling this sold out. I can promise you that. We will be calling this sold out sometime within the next couple of hours. You know, the thing is, Wolfgang, whether you're doing sweet, whether you're doing savory, it all starts with the right mixing bowl, right? Yeah, absolutely. And you need them really in your house if you want to make a salsa, if you want to make a vinaigrette, if you want to make uh, egg whites, you know, meringue, or if you want to make whipped cream, whatever you do, you need it. Look at that. Here I have a little salsa, a little uh, chimichurri, as they would say in Argentina, or salsa in Mexico. It doesn't matter. You add what you like. We have onion, red wine vinaigrette, vinegar, and so forth in here. And you put that over here. And if you would have that in the refrigerator, the onions chopped and the peppers chopped, guess what? The refrigerator would taste like or would smell like the salsa here, and it won't get out of it. So we have to clean the refrigerator. But with this, it makes life so much easier. So put that on your pork chop. It's a delicious summer dish, perfect for you at home. But you need a good bowl to make that. You do Now, indeed. another great thing... Yeah, if you want to make pasta, for example, I keep it really simple in the summertime. So I have my pasta here. All right, look in the pasta cooker. We actually were selling the beautiful pot with the colander before. All right, you put the pasta in here. And then I like pesto. You know, it's really delicious. All right, let's put some pesto in here, a little spoon. All right, and then a little bit of my seasoning if I found it here, because that makes everything taste better. And now I have to cover here with the fine grater, as you can see. So I'm gonna put that on and grate my Parmesan right in here. And you know what, Wolfgang, as you do that, I just want everybody to understand, these are not, well, oh, incidentally, turquoise is officially gone. So your turquoise is gone. Black will be the next to go. Uh, I'm, I've got a double header tonight. I've got my Shannon's in the house show starting at seven with Shannon Fox. We will be stamping that sold out sometime in the next hour, hour and a half. Now, all of these pieces that Wolfgang is demonstrating, they are included with your purchase. Normally, those would be things that we would call upsells or also available. So these are included. This great, this is a unique design in a spatula, not only because it gets every little curve, every little caress, but then there's a cheat sheet for measuring marks. 1810 stainless, once more, no warping, no tarnishing, no oxidizing. So from cheeses to chocolate and everything in between, there's that wonderful, what I call the insert lid, where you can take that top off and add additional ingredients. The peekaboo lids, one and a half, three, five, and then of course included for no additional cost, these great, they're bigger than a punch, or punch, they're bigger than a pinch bowl, but a mise en place for sure. Hey, Miriam, one of the things that we haven't talked about is you can use these as a double boiler. You can use it for your ganache. You can use it to do your baked Alaskas. And as a professional pastry chef, that nice rounded or domed shape is also pretty cool to have, isn't it? It is, and you know what? You try to find a cake mold or a cake pan, you're gonna pay a fortune for it. And then it's a unit tasker. I love that dome shape because it makes so many different things pretty, Shannon. But if you have a plastic bowl, are you really gonna try to do a double boiler like this? This is that weeknighter pan that Wolfgang sells under it. You know, you're not gonna do it. This is a professional pan designed by a professional chef. And if you look at any, every single set of bowls that we've done, we do them every year. Every single set that Wolfgang has made has been a customer pick. Now, why is that? Because when you get them home, you realize, oh my gosh, I have been putting up with the nastiest bowls. They're just all mishmashed, or maybe they're glass or plastic. You know what? If you went to Wolfgang's restaurant, you'd never see plastic and you'd never see glass. This professional stainless is what we use in the kitchen. And that's why you should do it too, because you'll pandemic a little better if you've got tools in the kitchen that are a pleasure to use. And that's what these are. They are indeed. Hey, just another quick update. And then we're gonna uh, jump back to Wolfgang. Uh, first of all, if you are channel surfing, this is the grand finale of our fall cooking edition with the Smiths. And I can't think of a better way to round it out with the one and only Chef Wolfgang Puck, who is celebrating his 22nd anniversary here at HSN. 
but get it while the getting's good. This is arguably certainly one of his top selling products, but more importantly, you're not gonna find his caliber of chef doing 1810 stainless steel mixing bowls. This is cooking, baking, serving, storing. It is all in one. Remember, they are oven safe up to 400 degrees without the lids. They don't warp, they don't tarnish, they don't oxidize, they don't dent, they don't turn into the bowls of shame. He includes all of the bonus accessories that you'll need, whether you're plating a salad or you're doing cheeses or chocolates or everything in between. That wonderful little, what I call the insert, lid where you can take that little insert out and add your ingredients as you see fit. Peekaboo lids with a silicone seal, one and a half, three, five, and then of course um, these wonderful little mise en place plus bowls. You would spend, I know there's a kind of a, a crazy analogy, but we love our pets. We love our fur babies. There are a lot of people who spend that price of admission for just one or two 1810 stainless steel pet bowls. I know that might be sound a little crazy, but the idea is with ES, there's a five-year warranty and a 30-day return policy. But Wolfgang, this, this is a lifetime set. People will be using these forever, basically. You know, this is really the best thing. It's totally a lifetime set. You know, you will use that for the rest of your life. Yes, it's bad for us because once you're going to buy that for under 40 bucks, you will have it for the rest of your life. If you give it to somebody as a present, instead of a bottle of wine or a bouquet of flour, you know what? They're going to remember and say, I got this from Shannon. She is so amazing. This is the best quality. We are all about quality, and I would not be here if I would not sell quality. So here we have our pasta, for example. Look at that. I showed you before. Now, what is great, too, if you toss it in here, you want to keep it warm. It will stay really warm because it's hermetically sealed. So, and look at that here. Here we have our beautiful pasta. See that? You don't have to go to Genoa in Italy where the pasta with pesto is so famous. I put a little bit of my seasoning on top. All right. To get a little extra flavor. And here you have it. Now, another great thing is how many of you out there Use a stainless steel one, a stainless steel bowl with a silicone bottom, silicone handle to bake. Nobody bakes in there, but here you can. And that's what makes them so extraordinary. You can bake in it. You can freeze in it. You can put it in a refrigerator. You can seal something hermetically. And look, the even cooking. See that? That's what I love. Totally even cooking, nothing sticks. So now, if you want to make French toast, if you want to make sandwiches, you can make your own bread, and it's going to be amazing. Look how beautifully cooked it is. Gary, you did such an amazing job with this bread. Look at that. I know. Hey, Wolfgang, Perfectly cooked. can you show that crust yeah. again? Because if people were just channel surfing, they would never guess that you baked that in a bowl. You know what I'm saying? They I look know. At that, look, like, that came look from a at bowl? the crust here. I know. It is totally beautiful brown, just the way I like it. If you get a good crust, you get flavor. You know, white bread has no flavor, so you need to get a good crust. And here we have our grain bread here. So we have all gr ground up grains and seeds. It's almost like a bread you would get in a deli for your pastrami or corned beef sandwich. See that? It is perfect. It has a great crust, too. And you can make it in the bowl if you want to, and then just cook it. So you have beautiful bread, easy to make. Now, Gary is making meringue here. All right. Very good. Okay. Now, look again here. We have, look how beautiful. So we're going to put that on top of our ice cream. We have ice cream with pound cake underneath so we're gonna make a baked alaska everybody loves baked alaska it makes really a great impression we make it at our restaurant cut when we take one out to the table everybody else wants it too and you can see i have my little spatula here with all the measurements on it so you can actually know how many spoons how many cups how many uh, uh, 
milliliter or whatever what the weight is so you get it all here at home you don't have a a thing like that so you put it underneath your broiler it's like making marshmallow wolfgang we are busy and we see you there okay, remember well, now can you see here look at that out of something totally ordinary a little ice cream and pound cake look what we make you can put a little chocolate sauce or a little raspberry sauce on top here and that's it see that i if if, if you make that at home and people come over for dinner, they're going to tell you and say, Wolfgang, you went to a pastry school or you went anything, but it's so easy. If you don't have a good bowl, you won't be able to make meringue just like that. It's now, true. in the little ones, we also make uh, uh, and bake in it. Now, look at that here. So, Gary, thank you. So, we made red velvet cake here. You can see we bake it in the little one. Especially if you get the three extra one, it's really a good idea because then you can bake five of them. So you could do those look little molten lava cakes in this Wolfgang? Yeah, you can put the lava cakes in here. You can put anything you like in here. It makes it really easy. Serve them with a little whipped cream. Now, here we have it. Look at that. Over a double boiler, just like what Marianne had, we make a ganache or melted chocolate with some cream. And then... We pour it over our cake. Nice. So look at that. So you have a beautiful glazed chocolate cake. Life is easy if you have the right utensils. And one of the things I always tell people, invest a little money. You get such a good price here anyway. So for thirteen dollars or something like that, you get the bowls home. Now you have all these different sizes, the two small ones, the one quart, the three quart, the five quart, you get the graters and the slicer, you get the beautiful covers with it. I mean, it's an amazing price. I tell you one thing, if you go to a regular cook store, you get the big bowl with the slicers and everything, it will cost you the same price as here, the whole deal. So don't be crazy, don't be foolish, go out and try and compare. The quality is here. And also one of the great thing is, I have here this handle here, see? This is a great helper handle because now it's easy for me to catch it. It's easy to work. It, it won't is. slip out of my hand. Well, Wolfgang, they're shooing us along. Thank you, happy anniversary, Marion, thank you. I'll see the two of you with the last look and final quantities of that today's special in the Shannon's in the house, a show that actually officially starts at